This YouTube video will show you how to use fractions on your TI-84 Plus and the TI-83 Plus. There's some slight uh, differences between the two. For more good stuff, go to my website, andyborn.com slash math. All right. First things first, look over here on the left side of the screen, press second, and then the plus symbol on your keypad. The last key I press is red, so kind of watch that. And then uh, choose number one, about. Now, this is not going to work unless your uh, calculator is uh, upgraded to the most recent version. Uh, 2.55 MP or higher will do fine. Okay, the way to do it, uh, to put in fractions, is to press the alpha key followed by the y equals key. This little menu pops up here. Uh, these other menus here uh, do different things, but we're going to be concerned with the first one, frac. The first one is n slash d. That's numerator slash denominator. And it puts in a template where we can put in fractions. So how about we add 3 elevenths two alpha y equals puts in the template eight over twenty two arrow over to finish that fraction I press enter and the calculator gives us the answer as a fraction nice uh, let's try a fraction with a mixed number alpha y equals how about one half plus, and then how about 1 and 3 fourths? Alpha y equals, and here we choose the second one, this guy here. There's the template, 1, arrow to the right, 3, arrow down, 4. 1 half plus 1 and 3 fourths. I press enter, and you'll notice that it delivers the answer as an improper fraction. That's fine, usually your math teacher won't get mad at you. But if it says to deliver the answer as a mixed number, then what you need to do is uh, press alpha, y equals, and then right down here, option number three, we'll convert it to um, a mixed number. And if it's a mixed number, it'll convert it to a, uh, um, an improper fraction. So there you go. Oh, yes, one more thing. You can take fractions. How about one third to an exponent? Like, let's say we want to cube it to the power three. Look at that, our answer, 1 27th. All right, well, what if we want to do this on the TI-83 plus? We have to do a little bit different procedure here. We don't have the alpha y equals on this. Um, but we can do fractions just the same. My previous example, let's add 3 elevenths. And what I'm doing is I'm putting it in parentheses with the division symbol in between them. That is the same thing as 3 elevenths. Plus parentheses 8 over 22. And it gives us the answer, but it gives us in the form of a decimal. We can convert the decimal into a fraction by pressing the math key on the far left of the keypad and choosing number one, convert to fraction. And like so, and here we are, 711. One thing to keep in mind, uh, let's say that we want to uh, have it convert to a fraction all in one step. I'm going to take the one third to the power three example, and our answer would be 1 27th, but I'm going to press before I press the enter key, I'm going to press the math key and I'm going to select convert to fraction. So this is entirely all on one line. When I press enter now, it comes up instantly as 1 over 27. So there it is. I hope that this was helpful for you. Thanks for watching.